Alright, what up y'all? Planet of the Fakes here and Pigstar HH News. This is a messed up story about a young woman. It's uh, Bronx, New York. Y'all know the Body Politic Incorporate. And basically, it looked like she went to the hospital. Um, just strictly related, birth related, and wind up losing her life to coronavirus with no loved ones to even reported to so we're doing this story but i just want to remind people this system ain't for nobody yes it'll help you destroy another but when it comes down to the system in you they're always going to pick the system and that just simply means the generation of revenue which in turn is just more debt for the united states 24 trillion and counting so stop thinking that people are letting corruption go on for money it's not for money it's actually to put the united states in more debt yeah because for every dollar created that's more money the united states citizen owes and it's not united states citizens and government officials or retired politicians no just the citizens so when you wonder how we have a pandemic going around where not one politician got it but every citizen is subject to it you gotta side eye it but let's get to the story of isaacs and that's this young queen's last name her first name was amber they called her amber rose and basically she lost her life due to what coronavirus they're saying and she's tweeting from the hospital talking about the doctors are acting incompetent. So now y'all know why we call this American Holocaust. And they're making it just a part of everyday life that thousands of people are dying from something that shouldn't be killing them in the first place. If it's that. But there's a rumor going around that their hospitals are chalking up every death as coronavirus. And people accept stuff like that. You understand? So... I just don't understand how people could just sit back and let foreign companies pose in as places that act like their government simply get rid of them with consent. Your silence is consent. At amore-shikid.com, with a voice for the voiceless. And this is the story of Amber Isaac. Pray for her family. Got a picture of her baby daddy in there. She wasn't old at all. Look at her age. That was her Instagram up there. That was her Twitter, her Facebook. She was loved, you know. She was pretty young. You know what I mean? So check it out. And if y'all got additional information, let me know. I didn't see this on the news. With that being said, what you heard and saw was the content. For additional content, click the link in the description. Like, follow, share, subscribe, comment. Hit the bell, visit my community wall, and if you have time, go to www.amore-shika.com backslash TV. That's our Planet of Face 2. We are the new umbrella. Planet of.